Hey learners, welcome to my channel guys. This is Pranshi Verma. In today's YouTube session, we are going to learn data compression multiple choice question answer quiz. And guys, this is very important question for your AKTU and upcoming examination. Let's begin. In this, your first question is a bitmap image is made up of option A. Pixels, option B. Colors, option C. Sounds, option D. Samples, option E. Characters. Here, right answer is pixels. Okay. Second one is increasing the color depth means option A. A bigger range of colors can be used for each pixel. Option B. More pixels are in the image. Option C. More colors are in the image. And option D. Darker colors. Here, right answer is option A. A bigger range of colors can be used for each pixel. Okay. Next question. How many colors can be used for each pixel if the color depth is 4 bit? Option A. 4 colors. Option B. 5 colors. Option C. 15 colors. Option D, 16 colors and here right answer is 16 colors. Okay. Next question. How many colors can be used for each pixel if the color depth is 8 bit? Option A, 8 colors. Option B, 9 colors. Option C, 255 colors. Option D, 256 colors. Right answer is option D, 256 colors. Next question. Reducing the amount of colors in the image will option A reduce the quality of the image option B reduce the amount of binary needed for each pixel option C make the file size larger option D remove pixels from the image right answer is option B reduce the amount of binary needed for each pixel next question which is not an example of metadata for an image file. Option A. Resolution. Option B. Color depth. Option C. Camera used. Option D. Sample rate. Right answer is sample rate. Option D. Next question. Additional information about the image file is stored as Option A. Metadata. Option B. Properties. Option C. File summary. Option D. Pixels. Right answer is metadata. Next question. The number of pixels per inch in an image is known as the option A. Dimensions. Option B. Color depth. Option C. Resolution. Option D. Megapixels. Right answer is option C. Resolution. Next question. Increasing the resolution of an image means that option A. More pixels will be used to make up the image. Option B. More colors will be used to make the make up the image. Option C. The image size will be bigger. Right option is option A. More pixels will be used to make up the image. Next question. The binary code for each pixel is used to determine option A. Which color will be displayed? Option B. How big the image is? Option C. What shape the image is? Option D. How many pixels will be in the image? Right answer is option A. Which color will be displayed? Next question. Data compression means to decrease the file size. This statement is true or false. So option A is right. Data compression means the decrease of file size is yes. True. Next question. Data encryption and compression both work on binary code. Option A, true. Option B, false. Option A is right answer, true. Next question, what is compression? Option A, to convert one file to another. Option B, to reduce the size of data to save space. Option C, to minimize the time taken for a file to be downloaded. Option D, compress something by pressing it very hard. Right answer is option B. To reduce the size of data to save space. Next question. Compression in journal makes it blank space to send, upload and stream data. Option A. Quicker. Option B. Slower. Right option is option A. Quicker. Okay. So compression in journal makes it quicker to send, upload and stream data. Okay. Next question. 
Data compression usually works by option A, finding repeating patterns, option B, deleting random bits data. Right answer is option A, finding repeating patterns. Next question, what are the main reasons to compress data? Option A, to reduce secondary storage space. Option B, to maximize the availability available RAM memory option C to speed up network transmission times option D to optimize the data option E to reduce packet congregations on networks so here two an three answer is right first one three answer are right first one option A is right this is to reduce secondary storage space is right C option is right to speed up network transmission times and A option is also right. This is to reduce packet congestions on network. Okay. Next question. Which of these terms is a type of data compression? Option A resolution. Option B zipping. Option C inputting. Option D caching. Right answer is option B zipping file. Is terms is a type of data compression. Okay, I hope you have clear. Hoga. Next question, question 18 is what type of file is represented here? Guys, you have a sign by the way, according to you, I guess that you have to say 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 that you have to Okay, so your right answer is option C, web. Okay, so here is sign waveform file is represent. Next question, lossy or lossless? This type of compression does not get rid of any data. Answer, option A, lossy. Option B, lossless. And option C, both. So right answer is lossless. In lossless data, compression does not get rid of any data. Okay, next question. Lossy or lossless? This type of compression get rid of some information. Option A, lossy. Option B, lossless. And option C, both. Right answer is option A. Lossy data of compression gets rid of some information in data. Okay, next question. Which best describes lossless compression? Option A. No information is lost, but file size is increased. Option B. There is no loss in information at all after compression. Third option is files which have the exact same data after compression. Fourth option is compression that involves an algorithm. Right answer is option B. There is no loss in information at all after compression. Okay, so this is the best description about lossless compression. Okay. And is used for text and spreadsheet files. See, I have a short question answer type question. Mein padhaya hai. I hope you will be Next question. Next question. When is run length encoding used? Option A. When we want to compress patterns of data. Option B. When we want to decompress patterns of data. And option C. When we want to encode running videos. Right answer is option A. Run length encoding is used when we want to compress patterns of data. Okay. Important question guys. Next question. Makes the file smaller by deleting parts of the file permanently for above. Option A. Lossy compression. Option B. Lossless compression. Right option is option A. Lossy compression. Okay. Lossy compression is used in for example video files. Okay. Next question. Question number 24. The correct encoding of the letter C in this tree is option apple a tree the answer they came was according up option check it you option a hai, double one option B one zero option C a zero one and option D a double zero okay up option I hope visible hai positively I will check out there see key value on Kisra find cutting the guys some root notes are telling this is root note okay and they are children's note otherwise so this is our C okay so what is the value of C yeah so chilling sorry so yeah 0 and then 1 so now the right answer kya hoga? what is the value of C value of C is 0 and 0 followed by 1 okay so 0 1 is right answer next question 
how my tree is uses the blank space of each character to work out their encoding option a frequency option b order in sky option c number value right answer is option a frequency question number 26 how do you move through a huffman tree option a 0 is equal to right one then equal to left option b 1 is equal to left 2 is equal to right option c 0 is equal to left one then equal to right and option d is 0 is equal to middle one equal to back so here right option is option c this is 0 is equal to left one equal to right next question How do you calculate the number of bits of a body of text in ASCII? Option A. Number of characters multiplied by 7. Option B. Number of characters including space multiplied by 7. Third option is bits in Huffman multiplied by 7. Fourth option is bits in Huffman divided by 7. Here right option is second option. This is number of character including space is right. Next question, twenty-eight. One is which formula shows how to work out the percentage a file has been compressed by? Option A, bits in Huffman multiplied by seven divided by hundred. Second option is bits in SKI minus bits in Huffman. And third option is bits in bit differences in bits divided by bits in SKI multiply hundred. Third option is correct. Who is Difference in bits divided by bits in sky multiplied by hundred. Okay, guys, I hope you have understood the lecture today. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos. Please share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching. See you in the next lecture. Bye.